Hello everyone, Vasive back. Wow, Vasive here. Ooh, welcome back. There it is. We got that out. Ooh, struggling already. Welcome back to Reyes. Uh, we're starting the third day. This is the last tutorial, I believe. And we start off, welcome to third area. You always, oh, I don't care about that. Hello. I don't care. <laughs> it won't let me skip. Game pause, that's why. Nice, Vasive. All right. Yeah, we, that starts the same. Cutbert. Hey, buddy. Gary. That is not Gary. We got a new one. Swamp Giant. Oh, we got... All right, well, we need a name for her. 13 patches. Okay. So you build here. It's puddles. Let me read. Ah. It's puddles and floor to turn the wet wasteland and forest into swamp. Oh, so I could even turn forest into swamp. Okay. Here you go. We need a name for you. What can we name you? Ew. Oh, it looks so cool. You're Catherine. That's what her name is. All right. You swamped us. Uh, got a new ability already. Okay. Makes plant rise from the ground. These herbs, plants give tech. Okay. Let's plant some plants. Uh, here. <gasps> Smash the ground. Or is she like blowing on the ground? I saw no change. Why doesn't this always work? I'm so confused. Ah! She dusted the ground. That time it worked. Oh, got a person. She like dusted the ground with her little sprinkles. Alright, we got some technology. Neat. The peppermints. Okay. Uh, what was that? Spirit of the villages are not allowed to regain some of your strength. Yeah, I was gonna say we need food and stuff, right? Hey, buddy. Oh, this is new. Upgrades plant with natural aspect. To upgrade the individual plants, animals, or minerals. Okay. So, upgrade this. Look the growth aspect. Yeah, just did that. <laughs> they just shake. Good job, Cutbert. You'll notice the aspect appearing in the patch. I didn't, actually. I saw the little icon, but it's not there anymore. Oh, in the upper right corner. So click here. Really? I don't see it. As you can see, the growth aspect has added food. Oh. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, all giants have aspect abilities which can upgrade plants, animals, or minerals. Since there's more, the aspects you placed has kindled a transmutation within the herbs. Okay. Click on the patch of herbs, yep. Transmute the peppermints into tomatoes. What? How do you transmute peppermint into tomatoes? Transmute with a lesser growth aspect or... 
Okay, so it gives more food, less tech, and whatever the green is. Okay. I don't want a transmitter. Alright. Well, I had to. I guess that's how you make a swamp village. Starting with food. Okay. Aspects. Plants, animals, and minerals into more powerful variants. Okay. Don't forget those tomatoes also have new symbiosis. Okay. For each food on this patch. Using the transmutation and symbiosis, you can complete projects with ease. I thought that said seeds for some reason. Hello. They just build stuff automatically. The village has started the school project. Magic projects will be finished within a certain amount of time. Oh, it's so demanding. Okay. Click on the project patch and view the project panel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't forget, you can always tap space. Yep. Use the giants to complete the project. Make good use of the specialization. All right, got to pause. Now, we need some more technology and more food. Okay, so I think I can just build. Let's build uh, you. Catherine can build here. Sprinkle, sprinkle. Uh, and so it needed. Mm, we're gonna have to build some more food, huh? So let's have her build some more next to it. Once uh, her cooldown is off. And also, where's the timer? I don't see the ti timer anywhere. Oh, it's right there. And this is... I should increase the resolution. I can barely see that across the room. Alright, her thing is ready. Do it here. Sprinkle, sprinkle! Cool. Alright. What, you wanna fight? Dude, come on. Outdoor classes. Wow. Alright, do we need to increase our food? Like, turn one of these into a, a tomato? There we go. No, because we have... Yes, we do, because that's maxed, I think. Oh, no, we, yeah, we're going to have to, because this one's... I only can have 15. All right, uh, it was this guy, right? Yeah. If I... Well, these get bonuses from each other. Tomatoes. All right, so will that actually... Yeah, that's what I want to do, because... If I aspect that one, it gets bonuses. And now we have 18. Cool. Sorry, friend. Let's move you over here. There you go. Should be built, right? Nope. Need a... One more use of food. Come on, friends. Get you one more use of food. I like seeing my... There we go. Yeah, we got a school. Hi. Who are you? Nice. So there's nothing in it. <laughs> New abilities can be unlocked by picking up requested ambassadors. Cover your abilities to view... Does it say which one? Pick up the ambassador by selecting a giant and clicking on the text bubbles. Is there a specific one? Unlocks with... Oh. Oh, she a swamp ambassador then. Muck bomb. Unlocks with forest ambassador. Or maybe she's a forest one. Swamp. 
How do I know which one she is? Saint Adrian. No war. I don't know what kind of ambassador she is. She's green. Maybe it's because she's in a swamp land that makes her swamp ambassador. Okay, let's just go off that. Upgrades plant with toxic aspect. Ooh. Upgrades animal with herd aspect. All right. Uh, maybe we want you. Let's right click on her. Right here you go. Go ride, Catherine. Boop. Yep. Okay. Well done. Upgrade your giants. You will learn about prosperity. Okay. It's the total food, wealth, and technology. The planet summoned together. Oh, summed together. Okay. All right. Build yourself a village prosperity, which is total amount of prosperity for the village. Okay. You must fill the prosperity bar. I'm assuming that's what this is. Yes. Okay. Which you can view the upper left corner. I really like the art in this game. It's very pretty. Hey, Gary! Forest giant has very awakened using the fruit plant ability to swamp result in different plants. Tell your giants to raise the prosperity to 60. Pay close attention to the prosperity bar in the upper left corner. Okay, um, let's build Gary. What's this? Upgrades a plant with a leaf aspect, adds technology in what's Natura or Natura. All right. Stu. No, no shit. Gary. All right, Gary, you build there. Cutbert. Once Gary figures out his thing, we'll build you. All right, that's not going to yeah, see, that's what I was worried about. I was hoping it would build it, but it wouldn't be a... Uh, wouldn't build anything. I don't even know what I'm trying to say. All right, it's right under his right claw. So like this. I was trying to get the most efficient use, which that probably is not efficient anymore. I think I moved it too far. Hey, it worked. Okay, that works. And we'll build a forest here. There you go. Stomp. Cool. Uh, let's build some... Fruit. And what's this do? Technology Natura. Alright, let's do... Uh, can you build some... Oops. E. Do it there. See what happens. It sounds fun. Hey, Cutbert. Oh, we're going to throw some animals in here, too. Here you go. Boop. What do you got? Makes a plant rise from the ground. Tech. I don't know why I'd want poisonous. Sounds like a terrible idea. Yeah. All right, we're we gonna get person moving in here. All right, can you can this go away? Oh, right, blueberries. You do blueberries, right? Yes. Blueberry. Yeah. Probably be smart to do another one. 
Got no one wanting to move in at all. Wish it would show the remaining cooldown. In number form. Got some blurberries over there too. Blurberries. With leaf aspect. Sure. I just want to know what it does. There you go. Okay, now transmutation. Five food, four leaves. I lose the technology. Adaptation, plus three food if next to blueberry or strawberry. Plus five off next to dandelion or strawberry. Strawberry. Oh, this is a strawberry. Hey, strawberries. We like strawberries. Strawberries are cool. All right, so if I do this... Next to a blueberry or strawberry, plus five. Aw. So if we turn this into another strawberry, they should get bonuses from each other, right? Why didn't it work? Oh, because I got to do this. Derp. Yeah. Neat. Okay. No one's moving in here. Not quite sure why. How are you guys doing? You're full on food. All right, let's build a plant. I don't know why there's no people moving in this area. What did I build? Elderberry. Interesting. Okay. Pay close attention to the projects. Breed tomato within the borders. Do I just got to build a bunch of tomatoes? Is that what it's asking me? Cut bird. Let's turn these guys into... Oh, wait. They're already, we're already set. We're good. Maybe I gotta do it to these guys, too. Cut, Bert. You do this. And then... Tomatoes. Got a goofy little thing here. What is this? Tomatoes and pineapples. Um. Maybe that's what I need to keep doing because that's actually raising my stuff. You see that? So. It's you. Herbs. So I think that was warning me that I'm going to destroy that. But yeah, I know. What if I use your ability here? As me with lesser toxic. Marshmallow, that's awesome. Lesser growth, lesser toxic. Oh. Okay, I'm starting to figure things out. What was that noise? Oh, I made it. Nomad is about to spawn. In order to settle, the new nomad will also require a biddable area with some animals, plants, or mines. Okay. That should count over here, right? Where are they? Turn you into tomatoes. You guys are all sorts of happy. Where's my nomad? Use a forest giant and ocean giant to raise a forest... Yeah, I did that. The Swamp Giant has unlocked the Exotic Animals ability. Using the Exotic Animals ability in Swamp Giant in the forest to create animals. Okie dokie. Exotic Animals. Here you go. Uh, here. 
Looks like a dinosaur. These animals provide wealth. Oh, maybe I... You want to build here. Because those are strawberries. Your color seems to have shifted. Alright, did some exotic animals. Stoats! You sense a nomad roping the surface. Where? There you are! This area is pumped. There we go. Well done, new villagers arrive. Villagers always spawn near habitable areas. Plants, animals, or minerals. Have symbiosis. Where are the stoats? Uh. My stoats are gone because they built on top of them. That's not good. No, my stoats! Sense rumble beneath your surface. Chunk! There you are. Use the rock giant to create symbiosis off the stoats. I don't have the stoats. They got disappeared. I don't like that. You ruined my stoats. Here you go. Should have done it on the chicken. Because those guys are not gonna have blueberries. Here you go. Alright. Symbiosis. Use the rock giant to create symbiosis for the stoats. Alright, what are the stoats? Minerals. Okay, so build a mineral here. Yeah, go away, chickens. And bonk. Cool. Didn't activate. Those in Nogate work well together thanks to their symbiosis. Blueberries working with chickens, yep. Blueberries also have symbiosis, which work well with other plants. Use the fruit plant ability of the forest giant to create some blueberries in the forest. Okay. Gary! Alright, I have some blueberries. They're right there. Select the blueberry. Select the chance mutation tab. Okay. Strawberries. Yep. Done that. Use your fire. <laughs> I've done that already. Whoops. Yep. Before you continue, don't forget that you can always pause. Yep. I oh, got ahead in this tutorial, apparently. Now, see if you can complete this village's project. Make good use of your strawberry stoats in. All right, what do you want? Wealth. Food. Oh, food is good. We just need more wealth. Get working on that wealth, son. That's your noble aspect or better. That'd be more. Oh, did it already. I'm amazing. Specialization has caused the village to become extremely prosperous. Witness how their resources are growing. Yay! Happy giants! Girls, their huge growth, your village has become extremely greedy. Oh no! New path. Clan is attacking. Oh man, I made an asshole clan. Click the village and view the village panel. You can see how greed... The village has gone insanely greedy. What jerks? You can't push next one. It's paused. Witness how the village has fallen into complete chaos. You guys are jerks. Can I smash them? Dude. What jerks? The new greedy village is beyond saving. Destroy them. Use rock giant or swamp giant the ability to destroy the village. Heck freaking yeah. You jerks. Alright. 
Earthquake. Or Aurora. Healing and speed boosting the first giant it hits. What? My giants can get hurt? Alright. I'm gonna smash your freaking village because you guys are being jerks. The reckoning is at hand. Get him, Chunk. Chill the fuck out. Whoa. Wrecked. That guy just laughed. Village stood tall and strong while the other screed led to its own destruction. You can develop this by having the villages above in different directions. And so you unlock new plants, animals, minerals, and projects. Maybe one day the humans will be able to take care of you while you slumber. That'd be cool. But continue to be able to achieve developments. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, well, that's the end of this episode, I guess. I think that's the end of the tutorial, so we can actually start the game next episode. I hope you guys are liking it. If you are, remember to like, subscribe, comment. It helps me out a lot. Let me know what you're liking and what you're not liking. But more importantly, remember to spay and neuter your pets, adopt, don't shop, donate to a rescue if you can afford it, or open up yourself up to the possibility of fostering. It is a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and rescues out that are very much in need. Anyway, I am Vasive. Thank you for tuning in with me, and I will catch you next time. See ya!